Hark ye, O man, to the wisdom of magic. Hark the knowledge of power forgotten. Long ago, in the days of the first man, warfare began between darkness and light. Men then as now were filled with both darkness and light, and while in some darkness held sway, in other light filled the soul. Aye, age old is this warfare, the eternal struggle between darkness and light. Fiercely it has fought all through the ages, using strange powers hidden to man. The depths have there been, filled with the blackness, struggling always against the light. But others there are, who filled with brightness, have ever conquered the darkness of night. Where'er ye may be in all ages and plain, surely ye shall know of the battle with night. Long ages ago, the sons of the morning descending found the world filled with night. There in the past began the struggle, the age-old battle, darkness and light. Many in time were so filled with darkness that only feebly flamed the light from the night. Some they were, masters of darkness, who sought to fill all with their darkness, sought to draw others into their night. Fiercely withstood they the masters of brightness. Fiercely fought they from the darkness of night, sought ever to tighten the fetters, the chains that bind men to the darkness of night. Used they always the dark magic, brought into men by the power of darkness, magic that enshrouded man's soul with darkness. Banded together as in order, brothers of darkness, they through the ages, antagonistic they to the children of men, walked they always secret and hidden, found yet not by the children of men. Forever they walked and worked in darkness, hiding from the light in the darkness of night, silently, secretly, using their power, enslaving and binding the souls of men. Unseen they come and unseen they go, man in his ignorance calls them from below. Dark is the way of the dark brothers travel, dark of the darkness, not of the night. Traveling o'er the earth, they walk through man's dreams, power they have gained from the darkness around them to call other dwellers from outside of their plane. In ways that are dark and unseen by man, into man's mind space reach the dark brothers. Around it they close the veil of their night. There, through the lifetime, that soul dwells in bondage, bound by the fetters of the veil of the night. Mighty are they in the forbidden knowledge, forbidden because it is one with the night. Hark ye, old man, and list to my warning. Be ye free from the bondage of night. Surrender not your soul to the brothers of darkness. Keep thy face ever turned towards the light. Know ye not, O man, that your sorrow only has come from the veil of the night. I, man, heed ye my warning. Strive ever upward, turn your soul toward the light. The brothers of darkness seek for their brothers, those who traveled the pathway of light. For well know they that those who have traveled far towards the sun in their pathway of light have great power and yet greater power to bind with darkness the children of light. List ye, O man, to he who comes to you, but weigh in the balance if his words be of light. For many there are who walk in dark brightness, and yet are not the children of light. Easy it is to follow their pathway, easy to follow the path that they lead. But yet, O man, heed ye my warning. Light comes only to him who strives. Hard is the pathway that leads to the wisdom. Hard is the pathway that leads to the light. Many ye shall find the stones in your pathway, many the mountains to climb toward the light. Yet know ye, O man, to him that overcometh, free will be he of the pathway of light. For ye know, O man, in the end light must conquer, and darkness and night be vanquished from light. Listen, O man, and heed ye this wisdom. Even as darkness, so is the light. When darkness is banished and all veils are rended, out there shall flash from the darkness the light. Even as exist among men the dark brothers, so there exist the brothers of light, antagonists they of the brothers of darkness, seeking to free men from the night. Powers they have mighty and potent, knowing the law the planets obey. Work they ever in harmony and order, freeing the man-soul from its bondage of night. Secret and hidden walk they also, known not are they to the children of men. Ever they fought the dark brothers, conquered and conquering time without end. Yet always light shall in the end be master, driving away the darkness of night. 
I, man, know ye this knowing, always beside thee walk the children of light. Masters they of the sun power, ever seen, yet the guardians of men. Open to all in their pathway, open to he who will walk in the light. Free are they of dark amenti, free of the halls where life reigns supreme. Sons are they and lords of the morning, children of light to shine among men. Like man are they, and yet are unlike, never divided were they in the past. One have they been in oneness eternal throughout all space since the beginning of time. Up did they come in oneness with the All One, up from the first space formed and unformed. Given to man have they secrets that shall guard and protect him from all harm. He who would travel the path of the Master, free must he be from the bondage of night. Conquer must he the formless and shapeless, conquer must he the phantom of fear. Knowing must he gain of all the secrets, travel the pathway that leads through the darkness. Yet ever before him keep the light of his goal. Obstacles great shall he meet in the pathway, yet press on to the light of the sun. Hear ye, O man, the sun is the symbol of the light that shines at the end of thy road. Now to thee I give the secrets, now to meet the dark power, meet and conquer the fear from the night. Only by knowing can ye conquer. Only be knowing can ye have light. Now I give unto thee the knowledge, known to the masters, the knowing that conquers all the dark fears. Use this, the wisdom I give thee. Master thou shalt be the, of the brothers of night. When unto thee comes a feeling, drawing thee nearer to the darker gate, examine thy heart, and find if the feeling thou hast comes from within. If thou shalt find the darkness thine own thoughts, banish them forth from the place in thy mind. Send through thy body a wave of vibration, irregular first and regular second, repeating time after time until free. Start the wave force in thy brain center, directed in waves from thy head to thy foot. But if thou findest thine heart is not darkened, be sure that a force is directed to thee. Only by knowing can thou overcome it, only by wisdom can thou hope to be free. Knowledge brings wisdom, and wisdom is power. Attain, and ye shall have power over all. Seek ye first a place bound by darkness. Place ye a circle around about thee. Stand erect in the midst of the circle. Use thou this formula, and you shall be free. Raise thou thine hands to the dark space above thee. Close thou thine eyes, and draw in the light. Call to the spirit of light through the space-time, using these words, and thou shalt be free. Fill thou my body, O spirit of life. Fill thou my body with spirit of light. Come from the flower that shines through the darkness. Come from the halls where the seven lords rule. Name them by name, I the seven, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, nine. By their names I call them to aid me, free me and save me from the darkness of night. Untanas, Quertas, Chietal, and Goyana, Huertal, Simbeta, Ardal. By their names I implore thee, free me from darkness and fill me with light. Know ye, O man, that when ye have done this, ye shall be free from the fetters that bind ye, cast off the bondage of the brothers of night. See ye not that the names have power to free by vibration the fetters that bind. Use them at need to free thou thine brother, so that he too may come forth from the night. Thou, O man, art thy brother's helper, let him not lie in the bondage of night. Now unto thee give I my magic, take it and dwell on the pathway of light. Light unto thee, life unto thee, sun may thou be on the cycle above.